Gomard Scientific has recently introduced several new and advanced features to the pediatric house simulators. State-of-the-art total control blinking eyes with photosensitive pupils. The dilatation state of the pupils, the blinking rate, and light reactivity are easily manipulated from the tablet PC, giving the user total control. Our new cyanosis feature allows the user to control the pallor of pediatric HAL skin when hypoxic events occur. Pediatric HAL can be catheterized via exchangeable male and female genitalia. The lower right leg has an intraosseous injection site with replaceable tibia bones. For additional realism, virtual vital sign monitors are available in both fixed and mobile formats. Pediatric HAL has many other features, such as a realistic airway, breathing, palpable pulses, and bilateral IV arms. Pediatric HAL's airway can be intubated both nasally and orally using an LMA or endotracheal tubes. Intubation can be made more difficult by turning on tongue edema. Once intubated, sensors detect the depth of the intubating tube. Should the tube be inserted too deep, the left lung is automatically disabled, realistically demonstrating right mainstem intubation. Correcting the tube position enables the left lung. Additionally, pediatric HAL can be ventilated with a BVM or mechanical ventilator. Ventilation and manual chest compressions are measured and logged showing the instructor exactly how students are performing. Users can perform a tracheostomy procedure during a difficult airway scenario. Pediatric Hal has multiple upper airway sounds synchronized with his breathing. Users can easily control rate and depth of respiration and choose independent left and right lung sounds, which are synchronized with selectable breathing patterns. Multiple sounds are available. Pediatric HAL is equipped with several realistic heart sounds which are tied to a user-defined heart rate and selectable rhythms. This feature permits the user to track cardiac rhythms and other events with their own equipment, just like with a human patient. To add to this realism, pediatric HAL can be shocked or paced with real energy for cardioversion, defibrillation, and pacing drills.
An AED will display pediatric HAL's ECG, analyzes cardiac rhythm, and advise action, a perfect addition to competency-based programs. Pediatric HALs conduct of skin sites are conveniently placed anteriorly to allow easy access for pacing. Pediatric HALs palpable pulses are dependent on blood pressure. Users can also disable distal pulses to simulate severe hypotension. Blood pressure can be read using a sphygmomanometer and users can auscultate the court cough sounds. Pediatric HAL has bilateral IV training arms that can be used for bolus or intravenous infusions as well as for drawing fluids. In addition, he has IM sites on both his deltoids and quadriceps. Pediatric HAL is outfitted with a convulsion mechanism that can be used in conjunction with scenarios. The severity of the convulsions can be programmed with a touch of the stylus. There are two intensities to choose from, 